Yo, what is up fam? Welcome back to another workout. Today I have a 10 minute chest session for you guys. Now, if you've been doing workouts and you're not seeing the results you want, the secret is consistency. I'm gonna sound like a broken record, but this year, that's what it's all about. It's about showing up. Because it's one thing if you make the extra effort and you put 110% in one day, but you don't show up the rest of the six days of the week. You need to be able to be consistent. So right now, smash the like button or bookmark or save this video somehow so when you have those bad days, the ones where you just don't wanna work out, pop this video out and just show up. I'm gonna guide you through the workout. Just listen to me, you don't gotta be creative. I've got everything here taken care for you. All right, if you're ready to get this chest session in, let's do this. Did you like the video? Did you save it? Did you bookmark it somewhere? I'm telling you, when those bad days come, you're not gonna remember where this video is. So do that, I'm gonna give you a second. Did you get it? All right, let's work out now. For this session, we have a one minute warm up with a 10 minute workout that's 40 seconds on and 10 second transition periods in between each exercise. In terms of equipment, you're gonna need some dumbbells, a mat, maybe some water, and definitely cork yoga blocks. All right, all right, all right, here we go. First move, step jacks. This is just our warm up here, so it's a jumping jack, except without the jump, you're gonna be stepping out. This exercise is low impact and it's great for warming up. If you feel like you're ready, you can switch it up into a jumping jack, but just stay here with me. If not, step jacks. All right, moving into the next exercise, knee push-ups. Exactly what the name sounds like, we're on our knees and we're performing push-ups. Take your time to find your full range of motion here. This is your warm-up, so explore, make sure you don't feel injured anywhere, make sure you're ready to go. Jumping into the workout, first move, block press. With your cork yoga blocks near you, whatever height you feel comfortable with, we're performing a push-up on top of the blocks. It's imperative you maintain good form here. So that means shoulders right above your wrist and all the tension onto your chest. All right, quick rest period here, and then we're moving into dumbbell press. Exactly what that name sounds like. Grab your dumbbells, meet me on your back, and from here, press up. Make sure you really get the squeeze at the top. Because we're working out from home, form is imperative. Nice 10 second break here, and let me demo the next exercise. It's incline block press. So again, it's the same exact thing what we did earlier, except this time around, whatever height you had your block set to, put it to the next level up. What I really want you to focus on is making sure your chest dips lower than your hands on the block press. The whole point of the block is to create a deeper range of motion. Nice, moving into our next rest period. Okay, follow up exercise, 
dumbbell press plus fly. Exactly what that sounds like. Meet me on your back. You're gonna perform three dumbbell presses and then you're gonna perform three flies. For an added challenge, you can lift your feet off the ground and brace your core. Alright, alright, alright. Next exercise here, decline press. So set it up, blocks at your feet. We're performing push-ups right here. With our feet elevated, even though the exercise is called decline press, you're actually working on the upper portion of your chest. You're creating an incline press. Come on, you got this, hang in there. This is really chest intensive, but if you're looking for a chest workout, that's what we're here for. Next exercise, we've got dumbbell presses with negatives. So we have a bit of a rest period here. Now for this exercise, what you're gonna do is explode to the top, squeeze, and come down for counts of four. So try this rep with me, ready? Explode, squeeze, four, three, two, one. Explode, squeeze, you get the idea. Nice, all right. In this rest period, I'll show you the next exercise. We've got incline press with negatives. So now, bringing the blocks back, set it to an incline for your hands. Boom, add the negatives in here. Make sure you get that count. Four, three, two, one, explode back up. We're way past halfway, got a nice 10 second rest right here. Next move is close grip dumbbell bridge press. Exactly what that sounds like. Get into a bridge pose here, bring the dumbbells together. Now, how you get the most of this exercise is you push the dumbbells against each other as you press up at the top. Really, really squeeze to create the tension across your chest. Ten second rest period, here we go. Next exercise is gonna be diamond push-ups. So you literally just did close grip dumbbell bench press, now you're doing the body weight version. Let's get it. Right here with you, keep breathing, keep breathing, we got this. Nice. 
Nice, 10 second rest period here. Grab your dumbbells. We've got fly pulses. So from here, you're gonna open your hands out as if you're doing a fly and instead of contracting all the way up, you're gonna do three pulses here and then explode to the top and then come back down for another three pulses. and time nice 10 second rest period we're moving into archer push-ups now this is actually a pretty challenging exercise and if you're not able to do it feel free to go on your knees and perform the exercise from here this is essentially the body weight version of our fly pulses Come on, you got this. Keep going, I'm right here with you. And time, 10 second rest period. I'm gonna lead you on this last exercise, get ready. It's just plain old push-ups, except we're adding pauses. So in three, two, one, meet me in the plank. We're going all the way down and pause. Don't come back up. Stay down here. Pause. Hold it. Breathe. 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 Come on. And up halfway. Halfway. Just halfway right here. Stay with me. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Come on. We're just staying halfway. We're not even moving. And up to the top. Stay at the top. We're in this plank position. Keep breathing. Nice. And now back down halfway. Hold it right here. Come on. Keep breathing, nice. All the way down, hold it, hold it, and explode back to the top. Hold this plank for three, two, one, and time. Thank you so much for giving this workout a chance. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to smash the like button because that helps me out, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.